What is Memorial Day? Memorial Day is an American holiday that honors the brave men and women who died while serving in the United States military. Did you know? Memorial Day used to be called Decoration Day. This holiday was first observed on May 30th, 1868 to honor people who died fighting in the Civil War. 5,000 people gathered at Arlington National Cemetery to decorate the graves of 20,000 soldiers who had been buried there. That began the tradition of decorating graves with flowers, wreaths, and flags. After World War I, people decided to honor soldiers who died during any war rather than just soldiers who died fighting in the Civil War. They did this to make sure that, in spite of the large death toll, every life lost was honored. When is Memorial Day? We observe Memorial Day on the last Monday in May every year. There is one theory that Decoration Day was originally chosen on May 30th to coincide with the time of year when spring flowers are in full bloom. How is Memorial Day commemorated? Memorial Day is a federal holiday, which means that government buildings such as banks, schools, and post offices are closed to give people time to remember the sacrifices people have made to benefit our country. In 2000, President Bill Clinton passed the National Moment of Remembrance Act to encourage Americans to pause for a minute at 3 p.m. on Memorial Day. This is a time to remember the sacrifices of fallen United States servicemen and women. To this day, Memorial Day is still commemorated at the Arlington National Cemetery. At the ceremony, a small American flag is placed on each grave. How can I celebrate Memorial Day at home? Many people observe Memorial Day by gathering with friends and family. Some other popular Memorial Day traditions include attending a Memorial Day parade, write thank you letters to current servicemen and women, place flags or flowers on the graves of soldiers. Maybe you could travel to famous military cemeteries such as the Gettysburg National Cemetery or the Arlington National Cemetery. Symbols The American flag plays a special role on Memorial Day. When you see an American flag, check to see where it is placed. The flag should be raised to the top of the flagpole and then slowly lowered to half staff until 12 p.m. At noon, the flag should be raised again at the top of the flagpole. The action of raising the flag symbolizes rising up and continuing to fight for liberty for all. The red poppy is just one of the flowers linked to Memorial Day celebrations. It originated in 1915 when Moynya Michael wrote a poem connecting poppies to the soldiers who fought and died for our country. Miss Michael sold poppies to raise money for servicemen in need. The idea quickly spread and now poppies are sold and distributed all over the world to support those affected by the war. To honor Miss Michael's idea, the United States Post Office made a stamp with her picture on it. Quick quiz! When do we celebrate Memorial Day? The last Monday in March, the last Monday in May, July 4th, on Veterans Day. We celebrate Memorial Day on the last Monday in May. Why do we celebrate Memorial Day? to honor soldiers who died serving and protecting our country, to honor postal workers and all they do for people who live in the United States, to celebrate the president and the hard work it takes to lead our nation, to practice raising and lowering the flag as a sign of respect. We celebrate Memorial Day to honor soldiers who died serving and protecting our country. What was Memorial Day originally called? Independence Day, Victory Day, Decoration Day, Civil War Day.
Memorial Day was originally called Decoration Day. Which soldiers did Decoration Day honor? Revolutionary War soldiers, Civil War soldiers, World War I soldiers, World War II soldiers. Decoration Day honored Civil War soldiers. Who connected poppies with the lives of soldiers and started a movement to raise funds for servicemen in need? Michael Jackson, Barack Obama, George Washington, Moynya Michael. Moynya Michael connected poppies with the lives of soldiers and started a movement to raise funds for servicemen in need. How did the U.S. honor Miss Michael for her contribution to Memorial Day? She has a holiday named after her. She has poppies laid on her grave every year. She has a stamp with her picture on it. She has a school named after her. To honor Miss Michael for her contribution to Memorial Day, the United States Post Office has a stamp with her picture on it. At 3 p.m. on Memorial Day, Americans are encouraged to observe the National Moment of Remembrance, National Moment of Remembrance, Minute of Silence for Soldiers, Poppy Placement Ceremony, National Moment of Silence. At 3 p.m. on Memorial Day, Americans are encouraged to observe the National Moment of Remembrance. What does lowering the flag to half-staff represent? A reminder to thank a soldier, a reminder to visit the grave of a soldier, a reminder to remember the sacrifice of servicemen and women, a reminder to honor people who serve in government positions. Lowering the flag to half-staff represents a reminder to remember the sacrifice of servicemen and women. What does raising the flag back to full staff represent? Celebrating life and living it fully. Servicemen and women will always be alive in our hearts. Honoring the freedom and liberty obtained through the work of soldiers. Rising up to continue the fight for liberty for all. Raising the flag back to full staff represents rising up to continue the fight for liberty for all. Which of the following is not a traditional way to observe Memorial Day? Placing flowers on the graves of fallen soldiers. Exchanging presents under a tree. Participating in a parade. Sharing a meal with friends and family. Exchanging presents under a tree is not a traditional way to observe Memorial Day. All that's left to say is Happy Memorial Day!